We've just been given a new list of things to find. <laughs> Apparently we still have that to do, even though we already got past. But we'll work it out. We need a car battery, a string of Ren's code, and a m get a model SAM transistor. I don't think this dude was any good at telling us where to get them from either. Looks cozy. What does Sam say about that? A bit dirty. He says it's a bit dirty. No, that's okay, Demothon. This one's been good, man. We did have a bug, <clears throat> but instead of being game breaking, it was a game advancing bug. Where we were able to, um, oh, we've already read this. We were able to get further without having to do something because the item worked when it was not powered up. Yeah, speed run strats. And the thing is, like, we didn't realize that we hadn't powered it up. We just thought maybe there was something. It was. It felt wrong, but what can you do? Like, not wrong as in, oh, I don't want to do this. This is wrong. Like, it just felt like it was incorrect. Turns out it was. And then in a cutscene, they mentioned something that didn't happen. I'm like, uh, maybe, like, don't know how much chunk of game we miss because of that. Like, all these things we didn't solve. Like, how many were there? And can we still solve them or not? Can you ask that in an easier to read way, please, Arrow? There's too many negatives there. I can't decipher what you mean. Or three. Speed running point and click does not make any sense. I think speedrunning a point and click is the best way to do it. Now, if we're talking like glitchless, what, you know, <clears throat> obviously, like, not skipping over the dialogue, you want to listen to it, but why would you want to take longer than it needs to solve the puzzle? Just walking around getting lost. Most of the time with point and clicks, it's pretty close to 100% anyway. Sometimes there's side content that you don't need to do, but <clears throat> I don't think many devs put extra content in point, and, like a lot of extra content in point of clicks, right? I, I, I think like at least 95% of point and click content would be like main, like the, the path you have to, to do to get through the game. You still have optimal routing and things like picking up items early, but you can do that anyway, right? <clears throat> and that, that usually happens in point and clicks, like you pick up items early just because you see it there on the floor. So yeah, doing an optimal route with and picking up all the stuff, I think that's probably the best way to play it for an audience because then they get to see stuff happen. You know, and don't have to watch me for an hour bumbling around through the maps on repeat, not doing any advancement. Oh, I don't do that, guys. I'm really good. I need that. All right, I wonder if we can give him the other one we have then. Negative. Apparently not. Can we swap it with the one he's got on the floor? It's good he didn't notice we swapped the cans, but stealing is bad. I don't know if anyone typed anything after the glitch. Oh, Demon Thorns optimal routing and four mans without hairs. Lol. Um, <clears throat> but apparently, I got welcome to chat somewhere in between there. Also, we probably should try. I'm going to try and power. This is the thing we didn't power up, but it let us go through. It doesn't show any particular emotions. It was trading. Yeah, we just traded him an empty one. 
So that's what it did when we put it on Tina, but it let us through. Because the guy said something about we need to use it on... Um, something to do with people with charged emotions. Oh. And I think she would be a good target because she got really excited. Reveals emotional distress. Yeah, but I don't know if we can use the phone now because that was in the previous um, chapter. Like, if we can use the phone to do the same thing. Holding this, I can pass through the bio scanner, but it has to be charged. It doesn't show any particular emotions. I calculate an 85.67% chance he's seen us, and a 99.98% chance his IQ is insufficient to recognize us. <laughs> Hello. Hey, hey! Valentina here at your service. You remind me of my Sam 47, except your eyes aren't as wonky. Are you not too young to work in this neighborhood? Only if your little girl's too young to shop here. The logic is sound. So, anything you'd like to buy? What kind of shop is this? We sell gadgets. Everything from a personal shaving drone to a pinball machine for your car. How about a synthesizer? Stick it on your arm and tune your body stick. I mean aroma. Woo date, or what was it? Ah, yes, impress at work. I don't think I need any of this. <laughs> oh, come on. Can't you just buy something? Uh, sorry. Oh, okay. Anything else? I am detecting that you are struggling emotionally. Well, yes. You see many customers around? I only get paid if I move this stuff. Are you having difficulties with the store's owner? <laughs> well, Maddie? Nah, she's cool. But if she doesn't get paid, I don't get paid. Are you having financial troubles? Who isn't in this city, right? I mean, at least nobody's like us. Anyway, are you gonna buy something or chat all day? I'm gonna chat all day. Figure out what is bothering you. I'd rather not talk about my heart troubles with a robot. Anything else? <laughs> Do you have a model Sam transistor? Nice. Do you have a model SAM transistor? I keep telling little Maddie to order some. Everybody's asking about them, but no, we don't Everybody? sell these. I do have a transistor radio, though. No, thank you. Actually, I should go. Bye. Yeah, let's swap to um Tina. Hi there. Can I interest you in an electric spoon to enjoy your breakfast? Um, hi. I'm Valentina. Just tell me what you need, little one. I'm sure to have it. Looks like something's bothering you. What do you mean? I have this gadget. It tells me when people miss someone or are sad. You mean an emosphere? I sold one of those last year. Oh, so you know how they work. Yes. So it's saying I'm emotionally unsettled or something? Yes. And I guess you Cheeto want to fix man. whatever's upset me to fill it. I think yes. next time I get a big well, bag of Cheetos. luck. My boyfriend broke up with me. Never said a thing. I thought we were solid, you know? Okay, so maybe we got to find the boyfriend. I want to keep two. Every time I pull one out, I want to keep the smallest one and the biggest one. Right? So the first two go on a, on a thing. Smallest one on the left, biggest one on the right. And then the next time I grab one, I compare it. If it's in the middle, I eat it. If it's not, I swap it. And then at the end of the bag, we can compare, like, and I can compare the biggest one to the smallest one. Maybe I keep a third one that's about average. I don't know. But... Um, not really. Well, he never got me flowers or chocolate or anything. But we just jived. So what happened? That's a little No one. idea. He ghosts me. Totally hacks my phone and deletes his number too. Means he won't That's talk to me. But I need to find out why he left, you know? Maybe I can talk to him. 
How can I find him? He goes by Eam. Just look him up in cyberspace. But I don't do cyberspace. Then maybe you can find another way to talk with him. I'll see what I can do. Bye! Hey, we have new contenders here. What? Oh. Right, about the same, but this one looks better. Ah. <laughs> you would watch a stream where we just compare Cheeto sizes. <laughs> I was too busy mucking around with my Cheetos. Did anyone get that name? Okay, seriously, what did we what did she say about her boyfriend? <laughs> Pants, pay attention. I don't want to pay attention. Well, actually I do want to pay attention. Could you repeat the stuff about your boyfriend, please? interest you in an electric spoon to enjoy your breakfast? Hey, I got the um, cyberspace Hi, group. I'm Valentina. Just tell me what you need, little one. I'm sure to have it. Oh, hang on. Here we go. What was your boyfriend's cyberspace handle again? Eam. Like E-A-M? Okay, thanks. I'll come back after I've talked with him. Bye! E-A-M. Hi there. Talked about Can get I interest you in an electric spoon to enjoy your breakfast? Um, hi. I'm Valentina. Do you have a model Sam transistor? I keep telling little Maddie to order some. Everybody's asking about them. But no, we don't sell these. I do have a transistor radio though. Um, I what don't happens, think though, that's if the same. Nine months later, I get a bigger Cheeto. Go. Bye. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I was referring to. Era, like, and for the small one, does it get small? Like, well, both of them, do they get smaller over time? Because, like, it's just sitting there. I don't know. E A M. Okay, I was going to say <clears throat> it's either um, manual Iman or uh, Emma Marx, but then I see this Emmanuel Albert Munau. That's EAM, right? Can chat, can you get me get me covered on this one? Ready with the typing? I'm going to give you some numbers. 144 Alright, we've got that.
Hello? Uh, Hello? You've got the wrong number. I'm trying to reach EAM, Valentina's boyfriend. There's nobody by this cyberspace handle here. Please. She misses him and wants to understand why he left. I'm not EAM. Don't bother me anymore. I'm sure you're EAM. Yeah? How can you be sure? How do you know EAM is a cyberspace ID? Uh oh. I spoke with Valentina today. She needs to know why you broke up with her. Hmm. I guess the police wouldn't recruit a kid to trick me, would they? Just tell Valentina I... I'm sorry. She wants to understand. She's really hurting. Just tell her the old Prime Bovaride bombed. I don't want to drag her down with me. No matter how much I miss her, I love her so much. I'd never forgive myself if the cops went after her. I understand. Then please, tell her to never again ask strangers to check up on me. It's not safe. Okay. I'll tell her. Bye. Okay, so... Fully voice acted games are good because I can pound the, um, the Cheetos real hard. But then when I go to speak, my mouth's like all dry and filled with powdery stuff. Okay, so that was the where the phone call was made. Pans pounds it. Hi there. Can I interest you in an electric spoon to enjoy your breakfast? Um, hi. I'm Valentina. Just tell me what you need, little one. I'm sure to have it. I spoke with your boyfriend. Yes? He said the Alt Prime override bombed, and it's not safe to be in contact. What? He knows I don't care if the police are after him. He said he'd hate himself forever and ever if he dragged you into it. But we were supposed to be in this together, no matter what. He said he loves you, and will always love you. I guess someday, who knows, right? Are you feeling better? A little sad, but... I understand. It sounds like you two really care for each other. But this city, all it does is pull people apart. I'm so sorry. I couldn't make you happy. But I do feel better. I owe you a big one. I'm not sure I can help with the Emosphere, but let me try anyway. It worked. I guess happiness doesn't always mean joy and laughter. I guess sometimes it's just peace, but... I'd like to be alone now. Good luck, little girl. Thanks. And good luck to you, too. Bye! Crumbs at the bottom of Cheetos bags just aren't the same as the um, crumbs at the bottom of um, chip bags. Like, the Cheetos ones stick to the bag. They're really hard to dump truck. So apparently now we can go to the, um, the bar, which we've already done. So I don't know what else we're supposed to do. Check it off for us. Oh, 50%. Are you Googling what Cheetos are? <clears throat> what would be the closest other snack? Twisties? Do you guys have Twisties where you are? Move along. I'm searching for someone. Except area, like or more air in them. Hey, you look familiar. Where have I seen you? You think you can bribe me with that? Ha! <laughs> Go away. Please. No, I want you to use it. I want to use it on you. You think you can bribe me with that? Ha! Go away, please. Um. Alright, so we shouldn't be able to go through there because it's. 
only 50% charge. <clears throat> I wonder who else we could have... Um... I wonder if that means we wouldn't have been able to see the dude that we saw that wants us to get us the other stuff. Um, no one there. We're at the slums. Uh, a Chitto is the same thing. Alright, let's go. We may as well check everywhere. We need to get... We don't need to get that stuff yet. We probably can though. Battery, string of Ren's code. I reckon we go to the computer guy for that. Or maybe the transistor. Or even the car battery. Man, that guy might have everything. What's up, Dick Bates? That's his name. Excuse me. What can I do for you, Model Sam? Release year 2053, Cat C Patent 18. Do you happen to have a Model SAM transistor? Of course I do. That's 400 credits. We don't have any credits. Well, I can't give it to you for free this time. Um, can you give it to me for something other than money? Like what? Potatoes? Yes. Yes. Not sure if they programmed you with a sense of humor, or if you really wanted to give me potatoes. The first. Whatever. Anything else? Bags of junk? Bags of junk? Oh, yeah. I really need more trash around this already messy store. Something okay. you really, really need, and that I can find for you. Hmm, there may be something you can do for me. Great. What is it? I'm pretty busy with the shop, but I'm craving my favorite drink. Bring me some gin and neon tonic, and the transistor's all yours. All right. We'll go look for it. See you later. Okay, so the gin and neon tonic will come from um, the bar that we do have access to, maybe. I don't know if it'll let us through a second time. Maybe it will. Um, but we should be able to get this charged up first, right? Are Cheetos like cheese doodles? Yes. You have cheese doodles without cheese. I mean, this is not a red light, red light district thing, is it? doesn't show any particular emotions. We're gonna emo spear everyone. It doesn't show any particular emotions. Oh, it reveals emotional distress. Ah. Hello there. Hello, big robot. What can I do for you? My emotion detector indicates you are sad. My emotions detector indicates that you are sad. What? <laughs> you, got, you finally no. got the question. What do robots know about <clears throat> sadness? You didn't anyway? Google um, doodles or red light district or altogether, did you? Three hundred human emotions. Really? Oh yes, you take care of kids. There's actually something. I truly miss my son, Joe. He never comes to visit me. He spends all his time tripping with that headset. Not far from here. If I had something to prove that he still loves me, I'd be so happy. You will? Maybe I can talk to him. Uh, okay. Anything else? Nothing. Bye. <clears throat> I don't know what Yandex is, but I don't know if I want to Google it. Okay, I need to find his son. The chef looked high? Probably is. Are you yet? Are you? I don't think this is the sun. The index is unfiltered, uncensored Russian Google. I don't know if I want to voluntarily use Russian websites.
Hello. Hey, Big Bot. What's up? Are you the son of Chef Hire? Are you the son of Chef Hayo? Uh, how did you know that? I'm equipped with advanced statistical tools, data provided by your father, coupled with my observations. Yes, yes, all right. What does that mad chef want from me? He really misses you, and wants to know how you're doing. I miss him too. Why does he send a robot to check on me? Hmm, all right. I'd better go now. Stay cool. We don't want to start a political discussion. I don't think it's political. <clears throat> Russian um, hackers is a legitimate thing that most people know about. It's illegitimate. It's legitimately an illegitimate thing that most people know about. Hello there. Hello, big robot. What can I do for you? Nothing. Goodbye. Wait, why can't we tell him about his son? Hello. No, no, no. Hey, big bot. What's up? Nothing. Oh, Tina. I should go. Stay cool. Hello. Hey there. Nice helmet you have. What can I do for you? <laughs> are you the son? Are you Joe? The son of Hayao? Why are you asking? I was at Hayao's. He told me his son's often tripping around here. <laughs> all right, all right. Yes, I'm Joe. What does my father want? Well, he's really worried about you. He misses you so much. Oh, that crazy cook. I miss him too. But I can't stand his mad ideas. Always going on and on about miso this and sour that. But I'm not into that at all. That's why I stay away. Well, I prefer cyber tripping. It's super cool. Have you tried it? Um, I prefer to avoid it. Your loss. Is there something you can give me to show him you still love him? Hmm. I have a lovely photo of us together that I always carry with me. Great! That'll be perfect. But I can give it to you only if you do me a favor. Ugh. Here we go again. What's the favor? The screen of my headset conked out. Can you help me repair it? How can I do that? Well, hmm. easy peasy. Just bring me a bottle of rocket soda. A bottle of soda? Yes. The sodium bicarbonate has a great effect on a bird's screen. <laughs> okay. Why not get it yourself? I need to walk by my father's restaurant, and I don't want him to see me. He'll bug me again with those lessons of how to blend beer and soy sauce. All right. I could do with a beer, actually. I'll see what I can do. Stay cool. Okay, there was a... It's not there. I think there's a vending machine up here. You could do with soy sauce? Okay, how do we get a rocket soda? I don't have any credits. Hmm. What's this? There's a slot in the wall. Tina, you're walking in front of the slot. Get over here. A disk drive embedded in the wall. It's convenient. <laughs> How was that? I don't know. Probably some sort of tribute. Cool. That's an achievement. Alright, at least we know. Okay, so that got rid of a piece of inventory, which is great. Because that's one less thing we have to use now. Oh, wait. oh I should have done this. <clears throat> Chips. Can't do that. Oh, because oh, it's a floppy slot, not a um, non floppy.
A vending machine selling rocket soda. We don't have any credits. Right, how do we get credits? Tentacle. <clears throat> I hope not to end up in one of those. It's a Neo Berlin Flybus ticket machine. The screen says, please insert credits. A lot of the vending machines you could use a um, a computer locking key to open. You guys remember when computers had keys on them on the front? It's like a <clears throat> the keyway was a circle with a little key nib on it, and that's all the key was was just a it was just a, a round a hollow tube with a little key bit on it. Um, and most of the time, I think they just locked. The, I can't remember if it was, if it just disengaged a, a wire or something that went like you just couldn't do anything on the computer. Yeah, something like that. Um, and vending machines came out with them. Um, I don't know if the old vending machines had them. Um, but at one stage, vending machines started coming out with them when they, when those keys weren't really a thing anymore, like when computers didn't have them. So maybe someone thought there'd be this, like no one would know about them or so. I don't know. But yeah, they used, they used to open up vending machines. We have no reason to go there at night. Couldn't get to the cash box, but I'm pretty sure you could. Like, you just open the front door and take stuff. Um, you know, but that's stealing. It's stealing is bad, and you don't do that. Um, we have no reason to go there at night. I don't think there's going to be anything else in here. Yeah, streamer does not condone theft. Okay, nothing in here. That's Crossroad and, and Historical. We go downtown. The first instinct though, when people like realized what was going on, um, I was in high school at the time, and a couple of people, a couple, couple of guys I went to school with um, had the keys and they knew what, what to do. And as soon as someone else found out what they were doing, they're like, oh, we should just go open it, go down one night, open these ones at, you know, like a train station or um, somewhere else and just clean it out. And I sort of and I said, well, then, you know, if you were doing that, that's kind of dumb because then <clears throat> the vending machine would be empty and someone would know. Renzo is a reference to a big YouTuber here. Oh, there you go. It's locked. <clears throat> it's just a regular store. Everyone coffee. There's a robot in there. Noodles. We don't need noodles. Yeah, I think that's what the the guys are doing. It just <coughs> just some, just something nice here and there. Uh, 
That's the registry office, so no one in there. We need to find someone else who might have them be emotionally charged. <laughs> Try stock market, then nice. Ooh. Did we try the Emosphere on um, Dick Bates? I don't think we did. It doesn't show any particular emotions. Japanese dude can't be used emotionally. He can. And that's how we found. He told us that he had distress, and um, we found out about his son wanting to, like, wanting to get contact with his son. It doesn't show any particular emotions. But you need um, positive emotions to charge it. It doesn't show any particular emotions. I wonder if the girl, if the twins could have been used. Well, they disappear though after you rescue what's her face. Maisie. I wonder if Maisie could have been used. She's not there anymore. Or maybe healed? Hey you! Remember to vote. I don't find two persons in Berlin with positive emotions. Uh, but we're in Neo Berlin. So maybe we have a chance. My mouse is on the fritz. Keeps cutting out. That'd be a shame. I hate this mouse. I'd have to replace it. doesn't show any particular emotions. Okay. <clears throat> There's no one at the shelter areas. That's all of the residential area. I don't think there's anyone else downtown. Hmm. Uh, <clears throat> I haven't been back here since the... Well, I haven't been back here since the new chapter start. There's no one here. Yeah. <clears throat> I think if we solve what's his face's problem, though. Um, he'll be happy, and then we'll use him, right? So where do I get we rocket fuel? Already here. Rocket soda. Frank, do you have rocket soda? Good evening. Good evening to you, metallic friend. How can I help you? You look half robotic as well. My soul is human, but yes, I have this mechanical arm, a robotic eye with a pro-optic canoca lens, a uh, synthetic liver, a plastic prostate. One of my kidneys is made of fiberglass. I have nanobots running through my veins. <laughs> he's got a lot all of right, robot it's stuff. Enough. I need to save memory. I can't handle all this info. I think I should go. All right. 
Come back if you want to hear some more stories. doesn't show any particular emotions. Hey, Crit. Um, <clears throat> probably looking to get some rocket soda. Convenient. Well, that solves that. Yeah, I was kind of hoping there'd be something there that might do something. That was a little bit too obvious. Because uh, the last time we went to that screen, we tried the Emosphere and went straight through and I didn't really look around. A 40 centiliter bottle of rocket soda. A 40 centiliter bottle. A full bottle of rocket soda. Here's the bottle of rocket soda. Great. Now I can fix my headset and get back to tripping. What about the photo? Oh, right. Here it is. Perfect. I'll go give it to him. Stay cool. Okay. Joe, and he gave me this photo. I'm sure he loves you. Oh, thank you. It's so nice. He loves me then. My heart is full of joy. Aren't you worried he spends so much time in cyberspace? I am, but he chose this life, and only he can choose to reject it. But knowing he still loves me, that he loves something outside of cyberspace? It means he has a way back. So I can keep hoping, which makes me so happy. It does? Then, could you charge a bit of my Emosphere? Your what? Here. <laughs> Just touch it. Um, <clears throat> alright. Thank you. I gotta go now. Good luck, little god. Alright. Yay, we did the chest. So now we're up to where we should be. We need to get a car battery, a string of Ren's code, and a model SAM transistor. 
So we should go talk to the dude that we'd already talked to. Just in case there's more stuff to talk about. Also, I thought of something. Where? Here. I was looking at the inventory. Chat, you got me? The Fate Mancer tells you your future with a 42% chance to get it right. <sighs> wow, okay, chat. Seven nine one nine zero four zero one five. You do it again. Seven nine one nine zero four zero one five. Get it right. <laughs> That's your credit card pin. So if that's Whoops. what you need, come meet me in person. Otherwise, leave a message. Unless it's you, Griselda. No, I don't know where you left your oculars. Don't leave a message. Check under the sink again or in your robovac, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, we need a battery. I wonder if this guy's got other stuff now. I wonder if we needed to do that to unlock... No, because there's the cops are out. Oh, battery! Alright, we need a car battery, a string of reds code, and a transistor. We also need an alcoholic drink, which we can get now, I think. Sam, unlock the car. With force. It's locked. <clears throat> Wrong combination. Now, the DeLorean you can't interact with, unfortunately. <clears throat> That'd be cool. See if there's anything in the dumpster now. <clears throat> but now that we charge the Emosphere, we can actually go through to the bar. So we should do that first, in case it also unlocks other stuff. We used the emosphere last it time and it just show worked. Particular emotions. I think. It doesn't show any particular emotions. Warning. Only adult humans can pass through. doesn't show any particular emotions. Tina, can you drink the thing? 
The emo sphere is now charged. The emo sphere is now ready to be used. Then use it. It doesn't show any particular emotions. Scanning if you are human and adult. She's like, oh. She's trying to scan it. It doesn't show any particular emotions. She should just be able to go through, though. Warning. Only adult humans can pass through. The list of things we have to find for Chip. Eh. Interesting. Robots and underage people are not allowed. Sam. She can't use it on that. <coughs> Sam can't use it on her. Use on self. It doesn't show any particular emotions. Should just be letting us in, right? Maybe it's something to do with her because it was bugged before. I hope not. It's a relic for Zamboni, but it sounds more Italian than Russian. Hmm. Maybe it's an Italian club. <laughs> oh, maybe if we take give this to Frank, he'll tell us what to do with it next. Wait. Doesn't show any particular emotion. He gave it to us, right? Good evening. Good evening to you, metallic friend. How can I help you? 
Who are you? I, I'm Frank. I'm 82. I was born on the 30th of April, uh, 1980. I grew up in uh, Dusseldorf. Great times in the 90s in Germany. Life back then was amazing. You could travel around the world and no cyberspace. Well, the internet boomed in the early 2000s. But that was nothing compared to modern cyberspace. <laughs> I studied at a university in Hamburg, and... All right, it's enough. I need to save memory. <laughs> I can't <laughs> handle all this info. Okay. I think I should go. I get all right, from come back if you want to hear some more stories. If this guy can charge it. If I ask the criminal. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Uh, when I went to use it on him, well, I mean, we never know with um, some game logic. It just gave us the no distress, the no known emotional ones. But if, uh, if this doesn't work, then I probably would. doesn't show any particular emotions. Mm. Oh, this guy's not a criminal, it's just we were here. Sam, please leave this to me, okay? All right. Hey, Tina. I was waiting for you. Regarding the items to hack into Sam... Did you find everything? Not really. Can you repeat what we need? I gave you a, a car, yeah, a no. string of your dad, and a no. mom. Thanks for reminding Take care. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't help. Check with the Russian dude. 